12 woke up on a really random mission this morning um there's bees that are need rescuing actually or the people need rescuing for the bees i don't know which one but the bees went into an office and we got a phone call and we're like yeah we'll take the bees so we called our amazing bee farmer and let's see how this goes <laughs> I can see him running out. I think he got bit. He was really excited. He said, Wakuya asasa. Oh, yeah. He liked it. I, it was, yeah, I don't know what that means, but he liked it. I hope it makes the honey. Yes, inshallah. Stay tuned. We're going to show you the, the next. Inshallah, this will be our second um, box of bees. They help, at least. Let's just get out of here safely. <laughs> Definitely some casualties. You can see his collar like all disheveled. This is like watching and um, fear factor actually. Early in the morning. Oh my god. Abdi's you wanna go? Oh gee. I wanna go but there's too many bees. He has the queen in his hand. Let me try. I'm <laughs> gonna That's so cool. Mission accomplished. Half of it is in the container, but the queen is in the... They got the queen. That's all that matters. They won't stay if there's no queen there. They're putting it in. They're just making little ventilation holes for the uh, queen. I'm just sweating. <laughs> Man, so I was actually helpful, surprisingly. I had to like pick, oh my god, he got bit right here. So I had to pick the stinger out so that he doesn't get injured or so that it doesn't hurt for like a prolonged amount of time. I've only been bitten once in my life <laughs> and that was while I lived here, while we were on these bee missions. Trust me, if you want to comment below and tell us how much we need a bee suit and proper equipment, no one's gonna wear it. Like try telling this guy to wear it. I wore it, but what am I gonna do? <laughs> they won't wear it, trust me, they're more concerned like they're more yeah they just believe it won't work and frankly it probably he's not getting bit that much right now so he's fine uh, <laughs> <laughs> Can't believe I was helpful. You don't want to watch this part, mom. <laughs> He's literally gonna scoop it. Get a knife. Maybe go get a knife from the neighbors. I'm proving to be very helpful in this average 
Midi maisa. Ah. Nkusa alin hawri. Interesting the different safety measures people have. So I was running with the knife because they told me to go get it fast. And everyone said, don't run with the knife. And I'm like, yeah, true, true that. But you also shouldn't be touching bees without protective gear. So if you want to talk to me about PPE, it's a different concept in Africa. <laughs> Your mom to the rescue. See, I'm not a beekeeper, but yeah, I'm a helpful. Oh, that you're Muspar, you're Muspar, you're Aggie, you're Muspar, 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 Anything you can engineer. So you get. So is this it all? So fascinated to watch. <laughs> And somehow my grandma's legendary shalmat comes in handy. They were like, shalmat can, shalmat can. We need something to. Obviously, you can't put a lid on it. It needs ventilation. So they were like, give us a shalmat. I was like, I cannot give you the shalmat I'm wearing. Like that's not gonna work right now. But luckily, in our car, we found my grandma's shalmat. <laughs> Unbelievable job done. Unbelievable. It's funny because our biggest question this morning was how are we supposed to transport this? And that seems to be the easiest part now. <laughs> Still, you have to drive the car. <laughs> <laughs> that was a long and fun operation. We got our bees, the part to take it to the farm now. Interesting. <laughs> 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 
هذا انت بقر كان الاركيني بقر كان الاركيني ها كل هذين هذين ما اسمه ما اه ويصوب ويصوب بحبحه يا عم هي وي ميري انت شنو ذا ويكس عراري صاب بوكس ها جاست ان تايم Okay, what to do with our bees? Is there already a box made? Yes. Hello. 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 ترجمة <تصفيق> 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 بس سأقول Mission completed. <laughs> if you guys like that episode, please leave us a like. Just showing you this random job of beekeeping that we were given today. Hilarious. Hilarious. Some of the things you just never thought Allah would give you the opportunity to do, like move to the motherland, became a bee rescuer. Anyway. If you like the episode, leave us a like and I'll let you guys know how it goes in a few days when these are making honey, making money. Shinima, will you go to the garage? Yikes. And in just less than two weeks later, here is a clip of our busy bees at work. But unfortunately, they had an accident. I have no idea how this happened, but their entire honeycomb that they worked on in just less than two weeks is on the ground sad so i guess that's how life goes you win some you lose some so i'll keep you guys posted on how our bees are doing hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out see you in the next episode